Hello there, Virgie Berg. Welcome back, guys. I hope you all are doing well today. This is going to be for, damn. <laughs> oh, death, the magician, the devil. Oh, we. Damn, Virgo. Somebody could be doing death magic on you here. Or they try to. Child, I can't I didn't even get started on the reading. Somebody could be doing death magic though. The death card, the devil, the magician. I feel like you're powerful enough, obviously, to defeat whatever they say is clearly, or you survived it already. I don't know, but that's just what I got with this that came out. You obviously could be going through a major change or major transition, okay? And there's some sort of uh something trying to work against you, but child, anyways. Hi, Virgo. Welcome back. I hope you all are doing well. This is going to be for anybody with Virgo placements in their chart. Make sure you guys flip and switch the roles and just take what resonates and leave what doesn't fit for your situation. Okay, um, anything you need to know about me is going to be down below in the description box. All right, be aware of the fake pages on other social media platforms and also on this platform. Okay, use discernment. All right, um, and if you guys are on a twin flame journey and you're interested in twin flame readings, you can... Um, check out my twin flame channel that's down below in the description box as well okay like subscribe share comment all right thank you guys for the love and your support so let's see what's going on virgo let's see what this is child what's going on for virgo spirit please return any spell work please any dark magic that is sent to harm the collective and their loved ones me and my loved ones return it back to the sender clear messages here for virgo what do they need to hear and know at this time I feel like somebody keeps trying to take y'all out and it's not working. <laughs> what else? What's going on here for Virgo here? I know my karmic, I mean, my twins karmic admitted to trying to like do death magic on me. I've been in two accidents. Okay. And rarely, I, I mean, not to say that that couldn't happen to me, but somebody here did some magic on me in my car. My car got totaled. I had to give me a new car. And mind you, I got to upgrade it. I got a Benz. <laughs> now I got a Benz. So it's like, I don't know, like somebody keeps trying to like do something to you and it's not fucking working. So, okay, let's see though. Hopefully the reading is positive. Hopefully something else come out. Yeah, okay, the three of swords. Someone could have a Libra Saturn placement. This could be a Libra involved. What else? The Knight of Swords in reverse. Yeah, somebody mad. Okay, could be a Gemini. Ten of Pentacles. Virgo Mercury placement could be significant. Then we have the Seven of Swords, child. What the fuck is this? Knight of Pentacles. That's you, Virgo. <clears throat> so I'm getting... Somebody here could be trying to steal an opportunity from you. For some of you, yeah. Somebody has a criminal background. They're up to some, some really janky shit here because they want some sort of money or some sort of... They want something that you've got or that you've obtained here. Or that you're going to get. Someone is heartbroken. They're upset about something. And I feel like they're being really, really belligerent. The Knight of Swords in Reverse is someone that's just very... Um, this person is a follower, too. They really are a punk-ass loser, okay? And um, they're very violent. This person could be very dangerous. They could be quite abusive as well. Whoever this is here, they put other people in danger. They put other people in harm's way without a care in the world. All right, I feel like somebody's trying to make you miss some sort of opportunity. They're trying to strategize and plan on how to do something because they're mad, they're upset, they're heartbroken. Three of swords, or they've been broken up with or whatever the fuck. And I feel like, you know, somebody is like mad. This could be a family here trying to attack you or plan something. Or there could be some money coming in. There could be a windfall of money, some sort of inheritance. Or this could be uh, something that your ancestors have passed down to you through your lineage that you're supposed to be getting. But somebody else is like trying to attack you or trying to fucking take it away in any way they can. They could probably be trying to fucking take you out of here. So that way they could, because I don't know. All right. So let's see. What else here for Virgo? The Two of Cups, yeah. 
somebody is sad about a connection or somebody is sad because you're in love with somebody. Someone could have a Cancer Venus here. Yeah, there's a third. I feel like there's a third party that's like upset or somebody's ex. What else? Somebody's name could be Lene, Toya. Someone's last name could be Jefferson, Janine. Someone could have a Libra moon. Yeah, this person is in denial. Two of Swords is like being in denial. It's like, um... There's definitely like a choice between two or a major decision or just a hard decision that you're having to make or your person is or you are. Flip the switch it. <laughs> what the fuck? Blo this app... <laughs> I need to erase this damn app. This app is so funny. They're singing Beyonce lyrics, Halo. Give me like a ray of sun. Burning through my darkest night. You're the only one that I want. And I'm addicted to him. I said I'd never fall again. Mm -hmm. Gravity can't forget. Something like that. And put me back to the ground again. It's like I've been awakened. Every rule I had you breaking. It's the risk that I'm taking. I'm never gonna shut you up. <laughs> However the song go. That's how the song go. Okay, so somebody here is awakened from something. So Hit me like a ray of sun burning through my darkest night. Bro, that's just so random. Okay, whatever. <laughs> whatever, man. So, okay, let, let's keep going. To a sword. I feel like I feel like you're ignoring somebody or something. Something is at a stalemate. Somebody's trying to cause a stalemate, though. Let's see what this is. Oh, Lord. I feel like somebody for some of you this is a person that wants to come towards you they are heartbroken this person doesn't know what to do but they're in love with you i feel like they're trying to avoid coming towards you because i feel like they could be like ashamed or embarrassed or something yeah the star with the ten of pentacles you could be dealing with an aquarius damn the star with the ten of pentacles Y'all would never believe that I can sing with the shit that I just did. <laughs> like, I could actually sing, but, you know, whatever. Um, Let's see what else for Virgo. My voice is in. It's too early to be trying to sing and shit. My voice ain't. My voice too raspy right now. Yeah, Knight of Cups, Pisces, Energy, Three of Wands, Bottom of the Deck. Oh. Uh, Okay, yeah, so this so okay, so this is the person. I feel like this is who you're getting ready to be dealing with. This person is is trying to escape something. They're running away from something. I don't feel like it's you that they're running away from. They're planning and strategizing on how to come towards you with the Knight of Cups. But I feel like they could be trying to get away from some sort of drama. Okay, they're trying to leave something behind here. Somebody that's quite abusive or quite violent. Okay, damn. And they just are in denial about something. This person here is a pathological liar too. They're very much so, I don't know. But I feel like you have some sort of gesture, a romantic gesture coming in a date. I feel like it's just discreet. All right, because they're a part of the Ten of Pentacles with the star. Something that's destined to happen for you. There's going to be a positive turnaround in a situation. Okay, so just keep faith with the stars having like faith and hope. Okay, um, being optimistic. Somebody here could be very, very spiritual. That could be the gifts that you have that has been passed down to you with the Ten of Pentacles. But some of y'all could be going into a long-term commitment with someone. Because there is love here. You and somebody are in love with each other. And somebody else is heartbroken about it. So they're trying to like, they're doing a lot here. So I wish people just let people go and mind their fucking business. Like, 
you wouldn't be so fucking heartbroken if you just learn how to release and let go and realize when some shit is not for your stupid ass. I don't know. And then you and then you get mad and upset and try to ruin shit that somebody got coming in for them. It's like that's loser shit. What's the three of swords? Damn. Yeah, five of pentacles in reverse, queen of pentacles here. Yeah, somebody's coming from out of the goddamn cold. Okay, like for some of you, your health could be improving. This person could have tried to take you out or they just been stressing you the fuck out, whoever this is. But yeah, this is... um Somebody here could definitely be a healer. You could work from home here, Virgo. You could have Capricorn on your chart or this is a Capricorn that's heartbroken. Whoever this is, they want this wifey title or this husband title and I feel like they're not going to get it because they don't deserve it. They need to go heal. That's what they need to do first. Whoever this is, is too, like, they are a mess. But the five of pentacles in reverse is definitely, some of you guys could be coming off, coming out of a hard time financially, okay? You could have somebody generous here that could be helping you with something or you just, who you're supposed to partner up with. The queen of pentacles upright is a good businesswoman. But uh, <clears throat> I feel like this is you that they're heartbroken about because something is, Somebody has let go of a relationship. Five of Pentacles in Reverse is re releasing a relationship. Definitely coming into better times financially. And somebody's like heartbroken about it. Or they're heartbroken because you're going towards somebody that's more financially stable. They're independent. And they're willing to share and uh, work with you in a relationship. Or, you know, actually be a good partner. I feel like somebody's like upset. Yeah, the Queen of Swords. The Devil. Who just playing the pentacles? Four of swords. For some of you, somebody here could be sick. Or like I said, they try to make you sick or something, but you could be recovering. You could be in the hospital or somebody could be in the hospital. Someone could have a Libra Jupiter here. So the four of swords is like, yeah, healing or it's like seeking solitude. Somebody could be a spiritual spiritual counselor. You could be a therapist, a spiritual guru, a leader or something like that. But somebody is a healer. Queen of Pentacles with the four of swords. That's like resting, recovering, recouping, planning for your future. What's the Queen of Pentacles with the four of swords? So this could be somebody simply like stress. Let's see. I'm trying to figure out who this queen is. Okay, yeah, Ace of Cups. I'm trying to figure out who this Queen of Pentacles person is. Yeah. I don't know. It's like, yeah, you bounce back from something that somebody tried to do to you. I don't know what they tried to do. You know, I did. We did see the devil, the magician, and the fucking um. What else we see in the goddamn um death card? Somebody's health could be improving. I don't know if they try to take you or your person out, but their health is. Somebody's heartbroken about that. This person is very demonic. Whoever this is. But you got new love coming in, okay, with the Ace of Cups. Or this could just be you healing. Like, I feel like you are um, healing really well here. Somebody could have tried to, like, make you um, emotionally, like, be hurt, like, emotionally. Or make you feel heartbroken or just upset a lot. Or they try to make you go insane here in regards to your mind and your emotions or something. But I feel like you're recovering. <clears throat> From something that they try to do to you. Yeah, somebody's health is improving. Could be your mental health. It could be anything. I feel like you have strong faith here too with the four of cups. Like you have faith in something and it's, it's coming to be true. Like whatever you have faith in is going to be yours for sure. But child yeah i don't know i feel like you guys are just resting you're thinking you're recuperating you're just you're working i feel like you know what i'm saying you probably got new love options coming in with the ace of cups i feel like there's somebody that you're in love with already that's for some of you all right it's going to be renewed what's the knight of swords in reverse hmm somebody i feel like you're a healer you heal your damn self you could be a white witch here you could you could be, I feel like dark magic was trying to take you out and you are a damn powerful ass witch yourself. So I feel like you have powers that you obviously don't abuse. That's why you're getting this 10 of pentacles and you use them for good here. Some sort of protection spells could be working. Yeah, the devil, I'm telling you, somebody is nasty here. This person is toxic. They are dem demonic. Whoever this is, 
their heart chakra is completely closed. Like, they ain't got love for nobody, not themselves. They don't give a fuck. What's the Knight of Swords with the Devil? What's the Knight of Swords in reverse with the Devil here? Someone could be on the Sag Capricorn cusp. What's the Knight of Swords in reverse with the Devil? Yeah, the Six of Swords in reverse. So this talks about making slow progress or slowly getting over something, slowly healing. I feel like whoever this is is trapped in their own. This is a person that has some sort of demonic possession is what I'm picking up off this. They just do reckless shit. They can have some sort of mental disorder. <clears throat> but someone here is like, trapped. this could be trouble like headed your way or trouble has been trying to head your way yeah for some of you somebody has called us cause an accident with the six of swords in reverse that's like i don't know if this is like a this could be like a, a disaster in the water this could be a natural disaster or some sort of accident it could be any kind of accident all right it could be anything but somebody here is doing magic because i feel like they're trying to like hurt you they're trying to take you out they don't want to see you move forward and they're mad because you're recovering and you're getting this new love anyway. It's what I'm getting. This is really indicating about someone's health. Yeah, nine of pentacles, three of cups, ten of pentacles. Wow, the page of cups, the tower, page of wands, the two of cups. What's this? Um, What's the six of swords in reverse here? The Eight of Cups, yeah, because you walked away from them. I feel like you stood your ground with this person, so they're mad. Six of Swords in reverse, too, is standing your ground. All right. And you walked away from this person because you desire more. You don't want to have shit to do with them. They ass is crazy. I wouldn't want anything to do with them either. So you guys could be traveling or moving, or you could be returning to somebody or returning somewhere where you just feel safe at. Could be you like returning home to your people's or something <clears throat> what's the devil so this could just be a warning that somebody is trying to um because somebody walked away from them or because you walked away from them they could be trying to send you death threats or deaths they're doing something to try to like I, I don't know i don't like this energy though yeah the king of cups yeah you have a spirit guy here with the king of cups that could be this could be your person that's coming in could be a Scorpio, Pisces, could be anybody. <clears throat> Damn, what the fuck was that? Who does King of Cups spirit? Give me more on this King of Cups. The moon in reverse. Yeah, something has been revealed. Something has came out. Okay, yeah, the Magician, the Star, the Ace of Swords. <sighs> Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio here. Something has been revealed about a King of Cups or a King of Cups has, has seen something here. Their spirit guy, somebody's spirit team is revealing something to you or you're revealing something to somebody. This person could be a spirit guy like in the flesh here. They're, they're a healer as well. They're psychic. They're intuitive. For some of you, this person here was married to somebody that was demonic. Or there is like someone that's working with a person that's in a a dark ass satanic cult or a damn coven that is trying to like take you out. So this could be why somebody is moving discreetly or they're silent or they're just, they've moved or they left or something. Child, what the fuck is this? Whoever this is, I feel like they love you though. They got feelings for you. It's just something that they're... Mm -hmm. There's somebody here, obviously, that loves you. They care about you, but there is a... there is. A, I feel like whoever this King of Cups is is representing to me a master damn occultist. Somebody that does dark shit. They kind of like... They got a criminal background with the Knight of Swords. They probably have taken other people out before. They could be trying to sacrifice you or something like that. It's something like that shit. That's that is something like that is going on here. I, I don't know. It's something that they have to give to the devil. It's like they have to basically a sacrifice, like I said. This your person could have been a sacrifice because I just saw the Queen of Cups matching the King of Cups.
Someone too is learning how to embrace their shadow side. I feel like they were like scared of it before, but I feel like they're learning how to use their shadow energy for protection now or something. Yeah, five of swords. They're learning how to fight back on in something. You know what I'm saying? I'm getting a lot. But yeah, let's see. What's the um ten of pentacles? The Eight of Wands, yeah, something coming fast. Yeah, Seven of Swords, yeah. Whoever's in the Seven of Swords energy with the Knight of Cups under it, yeah, Ace of Pentacles, they coming towards you very discreetly. I don't feel like there's lying or cheating going on. I feel like this person is quiet because there is something dark here. These could be people that are looking for this person. Excuse me. It's like the more these people don't know, the better. They can't attack what they don't know about. You feel what I'm saying? So I feel like this person is quiet. They're planning, they're strategizing, or they're taking action on a plan now. Eight of Wands with the Seven of Swords. Someone here could be traveling, they're moving, but they're coming. This could be them coming towards you because y'all, the Ten of Pentacles is like family. That's teamwork. That's working together um, to build an empire, to build a legacy. This is generational wealth here, accumulating generational wealth, obtaining generational wealth, whatever. Yeah, three of wands with the high priestess. Someone here is a very strong psychic, a tarot reader, a, a, a damn um, prophetess here. Somebody can see into the future. What's this seven of swords right here? Damn. Page of Cups came out in reverse. Yeah, jealousy, envy, hatred. Yeah, the world and the star. Somebody here could be somebody here could be an up and coming star. Someone is a master like um magician. They're like a, a somebody's very spiritual with the star in the world. This could be somebody doing something online. You could be it doesn't have to be spiritual, but you could be an artist of some sort. You're you're a trendsetter. You create things, you're an artist, something like that. But you're getting a lot of rewards and recognition. I feel like you're definitely in your purpose, you're in your calling. Okay, this Ten of Pentacles is meant for you. Yeah, the stars here, shit is repeating. You guys will be seeing 1717 or 717. Could be dealing with an Aquarius, Taurus, Leo, Scorpio. Yeah, Six of Cups. 22, 22, 2222. <clears throat> mm. Yeah, somebody is jealous or envious of you, or this is somebody that deep this person is around that's like this. this is bad jealousy i feel like this is why somebody moving silently you could be getting ready to receive a message from this person with the eight of wands here this person's family member could be reaching out to you so pay pay attention i just heard that loud as hell the hierophant knight of pentacles yeah and the emperor the knight of cups that's your emperor coming with this knight of cups here this this is your person that's connected to this ten of pentacles in some way Something could be happening within eight days, seven weeks for some of you. You guys to be seeing seven, seven, seven. What's the seven of swords right here, spirit? But there's like a lot of jealousy and envy and somebody's healing from some childhood wounds too. Someone could have been abused as a child here. What's this? What's that seven of swords? Yeah, seven of wands again. Yeah, that's, there's a lot of sevens. Yeah, page of pentacles. Yeah, someone is into some sort of divination practices. I feel like it's dark. Somebody here is into dark arts, but then there's somebody here that's into, they use their gifts for good here. It's whoever this queen of pentacles is, the healer. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Someone got a Leo Mars placement. Yeah, so there's a new opportunity coming in. Okay, um, that somebody is planning or strategizing. Somebody's planning or strategizing to do something to this damn person that's trying to come towards you. I feel like both of y'all really. But someone is definitely into like divination. You could somebody could be a really good tarot reader, or somebody is doing a lot of like uh, they could do earth magic. Whatever. If you just just done a spell to protect yourself, I feel like it's working. <laughs> it's blocking something out here. Or you could be sending protection out to somebody that you know is trying to get away from someone else. They is working. Let's see. What's the page of pentacles? I feel like intuitively you just know that somebody's trying to block you. So you are extra cautious right now. What's page of pentacles? 
something here needs a practical plan here. Yeah, the high priestess. I'm telling you, somebody is a master at, at whatever they do. Whoever this is, this could be you, Virgo. Damn, the high priestess upright. Yeah, Pisces energy. This is also somebody here keeping things silent, keeping things quiet. Some of you guys are studying um, your intellect. You're studying the occult. You're studying like um, white magic or you're just simply a healer. I mean, that's what a white witch is. It's just a healer. We have a lot of healers. I'm a healer. I mean, it's a lot of healers here on YouTube. <laughs> you know what I mean? But somebody is definitely have a gift of healing and it's just like very strong too. Somebody is very much so meant for... Um, you're destined to live out that lifestyle in this lifetime. This is what your ancestors have passed down. And whoever that's coming towards you is meant to be with you doing this. So there's a lot of protection here. Seven of Wands is like defensiveness. It's protection. It's um standing up for what you believe in. Let me see. What's the Seven of Wands spirit? Yeah, the Two of Swords. Yeah, whatever this Knight of Swords is in reverse Two of Swords right here. <clears throat> yeah, it's it's another person here that I feel like is trying to cause a stalemate with magic, but I feel like it's backfiring and now I feel like they they they're trying to escalate shit. They could be working with uh some sort of they could be a master occultist too, but they're just in the dark shit. Okay. But your spirit team, whoever your spirit team is, whoever I'm speaking to, your spirit team gonna step behind you, period. They're not playing with you here because you on a mission and you're fucking you're excelling at whatever you do here. You're in your purpose for sure. So there is somebody either this person, I feel like this person is protecting you. This Knight of Cups, whoever this is that's coming in here. Feel like they're ignoring something or something is just blocked off. Mm -hmm. You guys will be saying two, 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 yeah, the Wheel of Fortune and the Five of Wands. Yeah, there's like people fighting and shit, arguing. And this is this is all played out in a past life. I feel like with this twenty seven, twenty seven on the clock on the timer with this Wheel of Fortune right here, this is fated or destined to happen. Whatever this is going on. And I feel like, you know, you, there's a, a, I'm getting there's a strong communication or telepathic connection you have with somebody that they kind of like expect you to know what's going on here. I feel like you catch on quick or your person does. It's like you're following somebody's lead or they're following your lead. So if they're not speaking to you right now and they get ready to reach out. But if they're not speaking to you right now and this shit is going on, I feel like you're like, oh, okay, okay, I see what I need to do. It's like something like that, like y'all work together. Yeah, three of pentacles, thank you, spirit. You and this person work together really good here. Or something, like something very mystical here about y'all's connection. And it's like, whatever battle y'all going through, y'all making it to the finish line because this is lit, like, I don't know. This is very fucking lit here, <laughs> I don't know. Okay, but yeah, it's some weird shit going on though. That part ain't lit. I mean, this is some real spiritual warfare here. And I feel like somebody here is trying to fucking um take y'all out or something. But spirit ain't letting that happen. So it's just like, okay, whatever. What's the two of cups? What's the two of cups here? Yes, the lovers. A very strong fucking connection. But yeah, there's somebody's ex here. The a karmic... In the background here, they're trying to stay discreet in this reading, bitch. But we see you. What's the two of cups with the lovers? Could be a Gemini. Yeah, the justice. Yes. Whatever this connection is that's coming is your karmic justice. This two of cups is definitely, this is a faded connection. There is something karmic here too, though, that needed to be cleared out. But something is coming into balance between you and somebody for sure. Mm-hmm. Yeah, somebody's pissed about it. They mad that something didn't work or they, they're planning to like take you out and stop you from going towards this person is null and void, bitch. It didn't work here. It just didn't fucking work. But there's like truth and clarity around a love connection. And there's balance here. So, yeah, the balance. The lovers is duality too. It's balance. It's feminine and masculine energy being balanced within both of y'all. 
So that that's obviously, you know, hinting to the fact that y'all are ready for a real connection, a real like chance of this love shit because y'all are both balanced internally. Yeah, y'all could be twins here. Definitely a faded, strong connection. Very, very strong sexual chemistry too. A lot of love here between you and somebody. What's the Two of Swords? What's this Two of Swords? Yeah, Queen of Swords. Yeah, this is a fucking somebody here. For some of you, this is somebody's ex-wife, ex-fiance, or whoever the fuck this is. Somebody's mama or their baby mama, whoever. Could be a Libra or Gemini. I feel like there's something you don't see coming or you don't see that there's that somebody is protecting you in the background here. I feel like it's your person, but you just don't see it. You could feel it with the Queen of Swords. You're discerning it. You feel it. All right, but you don't see it. It could be leaving you confused. <clears throat> I feel like this Queen of Swords, Seven of Cups. Someone could have a Scorpio Venus. This bitch is confused. Let's see who this is before I start calling names. Because y'all know I don't got time for the fuck shit. What's the Queen of Swords? What's the Queen of Swords here? Who is this? Uh, yeah, this hoe. Yeah, three of cups in reverse. Hmm, yeah, that's involved with all these fucking people. This person is maliciously gossiping. This is somebody here that's quite bitter. Yeah, somebody here could be doing some like ritualistic kind of like work or they just speaking, they're doing spell work. They're speaking a lot of things out of their mouth and they do this shit. They chant it or something that they're doing here. They're speaking something out into the universe and whatever bad they're speaking out upon you is going to reflect back. It's going to go back to them, just period. Like if somebody is wishing that you die or hoping that you get in a crash or whatever the fuck this is, bitch, you are, it's going to backfire. It's going to backfire. It's going to happen unexpectedly too. This person think they so fucking clever. But this three of cups in reverse, yeah, it's like somebody overindulging in something. Or this could be somebody here canceling. Because this could have been getting ready to be someone's wife or husband. But somebody here canceled or called something off. Three of cups in reverse. Because something got revealed just in time for somebody to see that this person is fucking demonic. <clears throat> okay, this somebody here could have been could have been cheating too a lot. This person got options. They fuck around with other people. and But somebody here, I feel like they're just mainly in denial about the fact that they're being left behind here. And they still trying to do something that's just not working anymore. It's not working or it never fucking worked, bitch. It never worked. Someone gonna have a Cancer Mercury. What's the Seven of Cups? Yeah, nine of swords. Yeah, they nervous. They being haunted. <laughs> For some of you, this person's dream state is going to be affected first. This is how they're going to get signs about what's coming for their stupid ass <clears throat> for what they try to do. Because I literally, I was just talking to y'all. Y'all know I got a Virgo rising too. So when we started talking here about like a recovery period or, and this happened like, I've been into two accidents. This one of them happened last year. The other one happened, well, no, I take that back. Somebody here was really fucking with my vehicle, my car. Like my all four of my car, all four of my tires on my car got taken away. Like, and then I turned around and got an accident. I got an accident too. Damn tripping. I know the last accident I got into though was around like last year, coming into this year, I believe. And I had to get a new car. I got, yeah, I got my new car January of this year. And I had gotten to an accident where somebody had T-boned me like at an intersection and my car spun, but it didn't like the, the only thing, the only part of my car that got total was like, um, really, yeah, like a little bit of the side got dented, but the front was really fucked up because I ran into something. And so like the airbag came out, whatever, and my son was in the car too. So this bitch, somebody did death, somebody did death magic on me. I know who it was. It's my twins karmic. I know who the bitch is and she admitted to doing it. Yeah, the truth. The Ace of Swords the magician about this fucking magic. Somebody in someone's family that's trying to keep them stuck in a family dynamic. Yeah, Eight of Swords, Ten of Swords. Yeah, somebody trying to hex or curse somebody. They could be paying like a lot of money for this. Yeah, the tower. Yeah. Yeah, so this is like, this is giving me, um, some of you guys, this could be happening to you as it has happened. 
recently happened or it could like some of y'all this could be your situation coming up or you know hopefully not but i'm saying that that's what i'm saying here karmic justice is getting ready to be served for everybody involved you everybody that's getting karma the, the good and the bad is going to be here just period so i don't know but this not a source someone can have a gemini mars there is like um somebody here being haunted or they stressed they nervous about something because something has been revealed about this fuck. I feel like this is a cult or something very demonic here that something has been revealed about, okay, to this King of Cups. This could be this person that was married to whoever this is or they was getting ready to do something, but it it didn't work here because somebody is just reckless. They stupid. That's not, they're not as smart as they think that they are. They stupid. Without this magic, they ain't got nothing. They ain't got nothing, literally. This person is crazy. Yeah, it is swords. They got a mental disorder. This is, this is, yeah, it's something like this that's coming out in this reading that's very, um, talking about a situation that I went through. Yeah, I did get in an accident, but that was back at home, though, before I moved out here where I'm at. That was back at, at home. But what's the star? And I feel like there was attacking my family because around that time my son was sick. I was going to go get some medicine for my son from the pharmacy. And I got in an accident right down the street from my house, bro. Like, that shit is was ridiculous. But yeah, the Nine of Cups. What's the star with the Nine of Cups here? Someone could have a Pisces Jupiter. Yeah, there's a wish coming in for sure. A big one. Yeah, the King of Wands. Leo Energy. Someone here could definitely be seen in a public eye. Yeah, the Hermit, the Two of Cups. Someone could be seen in a public guy here with the Nine of Cups. Or you and your person are meant to be some sort of like... <clears throat> Y'all are meant to work together. Just put it that way. This person could be a model. They could be quite nice looking here. Okay, or they just... I don't know. They're well put together. But this person is a leader. So I feel like this person is coming towards you to assert themselves. I'm also getting... Yeah, somebody is finding their purpose in life. They're going towards what they're passionate about. I feel like that's you. You're a part of that. For some of you guys, you're meant to have a baby here. The Nine of Cups is conception. So some of you guys are going to conceive. Or there's something that you're getting ready to birth that's new with this person. But I, feel, I don't know. I feel like there's something good coming in with some sex or something. <laughs> this person too, they they packing too. Whoever this is, Virgo. Could be in a, somebody could be on a Virgo Leo cusp. A Leo Virgo cusp, I meant, or something. But whoever this is, they, you're this person's wish fulfillment. Wish fulfillment is coming in here. If you want somebody to take action, they coming. They is coming, honey. And they got this 10 of pentacles for your ass. So y'all getting ready to build this. Mm-mm. What's the Knight of Cups? The Judgment, yeah. And the Knight of Cups, yeah. The confirmation, whoever this is, is coming. This person is coming, seriously. It's <laughs> like... <laughs> mm -mm. This person can have strong Pisces in their chart. Scorpio, Aries, Leo, Sag, somewhere in their chart. But they come in. This person here, they're going to ask you for forgiveness, I guess. Because this is drama back here. Whatever this shit is. But I feel like you know about it, though. You know about it. You're understanding of it because of what you do for work, possibly. You could be some sort of master. Like, you could be a very strong spiritualist or something, Virgo. And I feel like whoever this is is getting ready. You're getting ready to date somebody. You're getting ready to go out on a date. <laughs> This is a romantic gesture. Somebody from your past is coming back. They could definitely live at a distance. I do see travel. But something is being renewed. It's being resurrected here. Some sort of karmic lessons have been learned. And somebody has made their decision. The judgment upright is being decisive. It's an awakening. So somebody is waking up to their feelings for you here. And following their heart with the Knight of Cups. So this is you. But honey, something beautiful is getting ready to happen with you and somebody. This person could be watching Tarot here. They could be getting into what you do. If you're a tarot reader or if you do something spiritual, yeah, private relationship. Y'all getting ready to be booed up here in private where it's peaceful at, period. 
because there's a lot of fuck shit going on. I feel like if this is like some sort of a call that's trying to attack y'all's union, they y'all need to be private. You know, what's the point of fucking um letting it be known that you're in something like this? There's a lot of people trying to attack it. It looks like to me, what's um. So we have, yeah, idol. Yeah, love, respected, admired, idolized, fan. Yeah, then we have bad reputation, yeah, in reverse. So, so yeah, your reputation is getting cleaned up here because somebody here obviously tried to ruin it. But you're being seen as the, the fucking star here. You're being seen as the one that is upright. You're an upright person. You have morals, you have integrity. People respect you, yeah, caution. Yeah, don't fuck with you, that's what I'm saying, caution. Stop fucking playing. <laughs> Somebody here keep playing with you. They were warned to stop playing with you like this. Whoever this three of swords is that's upset or mad because they didn't, what, get some clout off of you or whoever this is. Yeah, they were warned to stop doing that shit to you and stop fucking with this damn union and they didn't listen. They didn't listen. <laughs> they just didn't listen. Okay. Or spirit, like I said, I told you this is a warning. Somebody is trying to like attack you. It's caution here. What's caution spirit? Give me clear messages for this caution card. Kissing ass. What's caution with kissing ass? For some of you guys, you could have tried to warn your person about somebody like this. What's caution with kissing ass here? Bankrupt. Yeah. I feel like this is where you try to warn your person about something, but they, they were not aware. This person was asleep or something. They were not aware of whatever this is. This is somebody that will do anything to fucking save their own ass. They will hurt anybody to save their own self here. But this person getting ready to be broke. Or for some of you, somebody tried to do something to your shit and now they ass is getting ready to reverse. What else? Yeah, moving. Yeah, somebody leaving. Yep, moving <laughs> under spiritual attack, fighting off negative energies, fighting spiritual warfare, needing to clear your energy and worst nightmare. Yeah, somebody realized that they was dealing with some sort of demonic ass energy. Yeah, screenshot. Somebody got evidence of somebody doing something. Yeah, girl fight, impersonator, recording. Mm hmm. Somebody here tried to attack someone spiritually first before they took action in the 3D to hurt somebody. That's what I'm getting because this is some sort of like plot of a crime. Somebody really tried to like hurt someone. They really tried to like take someone out here and it back, it didn't work. Now they ass is nervous here. What else? Yeah, envy. <laughs> All because somebody is jealous, envious, just stupid. Putting them in their place, envy. Nightmares, yeah, insomnia, paranoia, anxiety, un unable to sleep, sees things under eye bags. <laughs> and then we have, yeah, somebody is like stressed. They all over the place. They don't know what to do. They don't know what to do here. Mm. Yeah, this person here is, Spirit has been trying to warn someone through their dream state, through their nightmares and shit like that. Somebody's getting really bad dreams about someone that is trying somebody is somebody could have sleep paralysis where you know that that sleep where you feel stuck i didn't i had that back like a long time i don't get that anymore though thank god you know i don't because that shit is not cool when i when i was dealing with sleep paralysis somebody was doing heavy spell work on me back then too i didn't realize it that i had a karmic like this doing some shit to me too back then but I feel like you have sleep paralysis when a, a demon is trying to like hurt you or somebody around you is trying to like hurt you. Yeah, I feel like whoever this is though, it's getting ready, it's backfiring on this hoe. Whoever this is right here, what else? Yeah. Wolf in sheep's clothing in reverse. Yeah, so somebody is saying that you're authentic. Somebody is saying that you're not the fake one here. Or you're not the one trying to betray them. It's someone else. Yeah, fake accounts. Fake social media accounts to spy. Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, etc. 
and haunted yeah damn somebody here <laughs> the same entity that they sent to like hurt you or attack you is coming back on them or they're they're fucking they're inside they're, the entity is inside of them it's taking over them i feel like whoever this is they don't even realize it they sitting up here doing stupid shit memories flashbacks trauma side effects Somebody here could be behind fake accounts. Somebody could be pretending to be your person behind their account, like their actual account, okay? Because I just recently felt like that. Like, whoever is on my person's account on their, like, uh, their fucking social media accounts is not them. It's somebody else. So be careful with that, too. I feel like this person is going to appear in a different way than what you expect. For some of you, this person has a burner account. They have a fake account here. That's, they, they could be watching you and shit or planning to reach out to you from a fake account of theirs because maybe their accounts could be hacked or something like that. So you got to be careful because it's something where this person, they got to move like this because whatever this is, it's some sort of secret society, some sort of cult. It's dangerous. It's, that's what I'm getting. Okay. And for some of you, this person is moving. All right. What's, what's this fake accounts card? Or for some of you, they're realizing that somebody, this whoever this is, was making fake accounts to you. Maybe they thought it was you behind those accounts wilding out or doing stupid shit, but it's really their karmic behind a fake account with your pictures. Yeah, the police. Yeah. For some of you, somebody is going to jail for, for cyberbullying or um, I'm hearing defamation of character or stalking. Somebody's going to jail for being a stalker. What's the fake accounts with the police here? Or police is behind. Uh, this is some sort of corrupt system. The police is watching somebody. What's the police with the fake accounts? Brainstorming. Ideas, problem solving, figuring shit out. Yeah, and keeping a promise. Yeah, this is your person trying to come back. They're just really quiet. I feel like it's a lot of weird shit going on here. Hmm. Yeah, let's see what else. Threatening came out in reverse. Intimidating, threatened, and bothered. Yeah, I feel like y'all don't give a fuck. If somebody's threatened and bothered by you, but I feel like you don't care. You're not threatened and bothered by nobody ass. <laughs> Period. Or somebody got some legal shit in place to where it could stop this person from being a fuck like harassing you or something like that. Dirt digging, looking for dirt on you, or vice versa. Yeah, and then we have running. Yeah, somebody getting a fuck. <laughs> Whoever this is, they are leaving. They leave. I feel like somebody got jilted. Mm-hmm. Child, what's running here? What's running? Shine. Yeah, your light irritates their talks, their demons. Confused, investigating, fake friends. Yeah, these people are confused on how this shit <laughs> it didn't work or whatever the fuck they try to do. They're trying to get run away from this karma. That's what they're trying to do. But they can't. What's dirt digging? For some of you, yeah, somebody was doing some fuck. I see this cross here with dirt digging. Somebody was doing some fucking uh uh, death magic they were they were trying to take you out i keep getting that what's, what's the dirt digging talking shit and then we have aligning yourself with the universe yeah this person really hates the fact that you're spiritual or you're very much so balanced and you kept calm through all of whatever this is that happened they was building a grave for you here now they're about to be in it <laughs> for some of you this is exactly it's going to reverse whatever this is that they did what else? What a shame. You hate somebody that bad that you try to kill their ass. That's crazy. Yeah, confused. Family time. And we have sick. Yeah, in reverse. Somebody's health is improving here.
they're trying to figure out why they what they're doing is not working or they're trying to like make you sick in some kind of way or something like that but you're not someone here could be healing from something though i don't know it could be a disease it could be bless me it could be what's this sick card in reverse because i see caught up finding evidence getting caught cheating so somebody could have an scd all right well what's sick in reverse Hooked, yes, yeah, yes, yeah, sex for some of you. Someone here could have tried to set you up with somebody that had something to make you look a certain kind of way. I don't know. They was really trying to. They was. I don't know if they were trying to make you just live a certain kind of lifestyle. What's this sick in reverse with hooked? Or it's like you're not um, hooked on, it's not, you're not hooked on this person's sex no more. Where if they were doing some sort of sex magic on you or something to where they could, they were doing something to keep you hooked to them. I feel like you're not anymore. But some of you, somebody's healing from an STD, something that they could actually get rid of. So that's good here. Yeah, copycat. Uh, child, what the fuck? They, they wanted to be you here. So, of course, they try to take you out. What's family time? This could definitely be somebody that's in someone's family or that someone got kids with. Someone's ex-wife, ex-husband, whoever the fuck. Yeah, fake friends. Yeah, man. This is crazy. What else? Sex shop. <laughs> What else? Yeah, somebody could be healing from that. What's the what else, spirit? Keeping you a secret and fed up. Yeah, somebody is fed up here. I feel like, yeah, this person is protecting you. That's what I'm getting. But honey, I feel like this person is coming in with some sort of like they trying to co-create with you. Procreate too. Both of them, really. <laughs> That's what I'm getting. This person is a uh, what sex shop? I hate nothing about you. <laughs> and then we have romantic love affair, sex fix, secret lover, fuck buddy. <laughs> I feel like this person, this is indicating, I feel like this person is in love with you. Okay, y'all could have been just fucking around before and just y'all just fell in love with each other and you realize that this is your person. This somebody you want to spend the rest of your life with. Child, this person, they in love with you. Let's see, though. What's keeping you a secret? I feel like, what's keeping you a secret here? I don't feel like this is a, let me see. Okay, yeah, thief. Yeah, because somebody trying to take somebody, something from them. It's you, thief. Rob thoughts. I said robbed thoughts, <laughs> robbed, lost, theft, physical or emotional. Yeah, travel and an offer. Yeah, this person, they coming towards you with an offer. They're keeping you a secret because they don't want, they're protecting you. That's what I'm getting. But honey, I feel like they coming in with some sort of like, they coming in with the right energy, but they definitely coming in to give you that, give you some sex. <laughs> like, I don't know. Like, yeah, once you back. Mm -hmm. this person they coming in here but they keeping you a secret you keeping them a secret i guess because of all this fucking shit that's going on what else spirit this is somebody's raggedy ass yeah marrying for money <laughs> incarcerated yeah this person probably going to jail for being a thief whoever this fucking um person is that this person left i feel like they left somebody that was using them for money yeah, and then we have ain't shit. Somebody here could be could have been stuck in some sort of connection with a damn gold digging asshole. That ain't shit, and they leaving to come towards you because they see that this is not that. This is like a false. I feel like this person is a false twin or something like that for some of you. Yeah, so they're aware, just like you're aware. I just feel like there's something going on with y'all communication right now, so just be careful. There could be a court case going on with all this police in the jail. The police is right over top of incarcerated. Somebody could be going to jail. So this person has to move a certain kind of way right now. But, honey, what 
the queen of wands the hermit the devil yeah some sort of like secret it's like a secret as i don't know the empress the nine of pentacles and the king of wands yeah they go that king of wands seven of wands yeah whoever this king of wands is they're protecting you this could be your person you and this person are battling some some type of like spiritual warfare all right we have the king of wands to the queen and the seven of wands and the page of wands yeah the fool they're gonna have a craze in their chart a lot of fire somewhere maybe yeah this person is like protecting you empress queen of wands i feel like you fine as fuck just like your person virgo but anywho child yeah mm -mm -mm. <laughs> this is your reading though i hope this resonated like comment subscribe turn your notification bell on press the all button so you won't miss any of my readings and i'll talk to you all later bye